Hi, it's Catherine. Today, we're gonna to talk about the power of permission slips. Hi, this is Catherine Morgan from Point A to Point B Transitions. And today I want to talk to you about the power of permission slips. You may have thought that you stopped needing permission slips when you got out of high school. However, I'll tell you that the need has not gone away. However, the person who writes them for you may have changed. Meaning um, in the past, our parents may have had to write us permission slips because we were minors and that makes sense. But now that we're adults and we're in charge of our future, we may need to write our own permission slips. This can be really tricky sometimes. And you actually may need to reach out to a friend, a colleague, a coach, and have them sort of coax you into giving yourself the permission you need. What might you need permission for? You might need to give yourself permission to try something new and not be great at it right out of the box. A lot of us, you know, don't jump onto the scene or learn a new skill or try something different with our business or our career and have blinding success. I know, you're shocked. I was shocked too when I wasn't immediately successful in my business or at speaking or at doing video, or doing anything. So permission slips are something that I have found as a coach, I have to give clients a lot. I remember a woman who came in to my practice very distressed. We actually met in person because she seemed to need someone to hear her story. And she logically walked me through what she thought her next step was. She'd been offered a job that paid enough money. She knew the person, they were an old friend, but she had some concerns. She suspected he wasn't gonna be the right boss for her. She suspected that some of her values and the values of his business were out of alignment. Basically, there were some good things and some bad things, like everything. But I got the deepest feeling that she did not want to do this. And I pulled her up out of this and I said, you know what, I think you need to give yourself permission to say no if that's what's the right decision for you. And she burst into tears. And we talked about why that was so triggering and what the real issues were. And she was wrestling with some stuff in her history and she needed to give herself permission to say no to this opportunity and have the faith that something different, better would emerge, which I'm pleased to report it did. But this is not an isolated incident. We, you, me, everybody need to give ourselves permission slips to walk away if the deal isn't right, to try something new and possibly fail. It's all really important and creates an interesting, healthy, innovative, successful life. I'd love to hear what you think about this and what permission slips you might be writing yourself as a result of watching this. This is Catherine Morgan from Point A to B, Point B Transitions, and this has been your Morgan Moment.